It's Bourbonite. Hello, I'm Chad. I'm Sarah. And welcome to the Flaviar.com 12 Days of Christmas calendar, Whiskeys of the World. That's right. It's day number nine. It's day number nine, and we hope your 2020 is going very well. Yes. Yeah. Hopefully those resolutions are still intact. <laughs> yeah, right. Um, <laughs> They're already gone. <laughs> for maybe you. Oh. <laughs> yeah. uh, but thanks to Flaviar.com for uh, sponsoring the series and sending us uh, this box to review. Number nine. There we are. Mm -hmm. Not looking. Oh, I didn't look either. I just saw the nine. <laughs> this is getting pretty light it's now. It's getting lighter. Getting towards the end. Mm -hmm. Would you like to pour yourself some first? or Because I'm a uh, queen of spilling, apparently. Lovely. <laughs> you know, Sarah, I have to be honest, and I and I think I can already tell by this book that I'm judging by its cover, but I was going to say, I, I really hope we get a bourbon today. Just because it's 2020, it's day two, our second video of 2020, mm -hmm. I'm just in the mood for a bourbon. He's just in the mood for one. But the channel is called It's Bourbon Night, so that probably isn't a surprise. Well, whatever it is, I think it's very grain forward. Yes. <laughs> I don't know what it is. That... It is. A lot of corn, a lot of grain, very. It's maybe a corn whiskey. Cereally. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Also some pepper. Sweet, a little pepper, yeah. I mean, maybe, bordering on musty. Maybe like an apple juice note? Uh -huh. That's kind of weird, uh -huh. but yeah. Yeah. Apple. It even looks like, maybe it's because it looks like apple juice. <laughs> <laughs> I want it to taste like apple juice. Oh, it does have sort of a apple and Concord grape sort of combination, you but definitely juice. It's juice. Yeah. Yeah, but juice really flavor. the grain, I think, is the number one thing on the mm -hmm. nose. So, all right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. <laughs> Hold up. <laughs> hey. <laughs> what is that? That is um, very <coughs> unlike many things that I've ever tasted before. Uh. There is a juice flavor, a fruit flavor, but kind of artificial. And then there's the grain stuff going on, but there's something else going on. And I wouldn't call it smoky, but I don't know what I would call it. I got a big cereal taste. Yeah, cereal. Not a long finish to speak of. It's kind of smoky, but it's kind of bitter also. Like smoked licorice almost. There's a Yeah, there's a little bit of smoke, but smoke isn't, you know, not like yesterday right? no 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 yeah <clears throat> it, it's maybe just char that i'm getting mm, i don't know there's a little bitter in there it, it's, it's sort of bitter. cocktail ish yeah. cocktail-esque i'll tell you one thing I, I i like about this is the mouthfeel i think it's it's pretty um pretty good at coating the mouth it sticks around there not so much in the chest or down the throat yeah <laughs> I'm getting licorice, so I'm e immediately like, no thanks. If you're new to the channel, she... No thank you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she, uh, Sarah, it, her turn off on a lot of, uh, well, any whiskey, is if it has a heavy licorice note. But did you get my Star Wars reference? Yeah, I, well, yeah. Well, I know you did. Yeah. No thank you. <laughs> no can do. It's like very sweet on the front, and then it goes into this bitter kind of licorice-y note. And that's just no can do. I'm not getting uh, a whole lot of licorice, Just but you know, little. you are more sensitive to the licorice note than I am. <laughs> what? Licorice. Okay. <laughs> you know, tell where the winds are coming from. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It was a joke. I make them sometimes. Mm. I'm getting the sensation of like old books, you know, um, archives but I don't taste age necessarily on the whiskey, but it's just, I'm getting that, yeah, it's more like a basement archival type of yeah. sense or sensation. I think it's probably <clears throat> four years or younger. Well, that's just based on my knowledge of American whiskey though. Uh, if it's something else, then I actually have no idea what this is. Um, yeah, I don't know. Is it Japanese? Is it Scotch? Is it American whiskey? Uh, Canadian, Canadian, Irish. And, uh, yeah, Irish. I don't know. I. There are other places too. <laughs> there are other places. Uh, what about proof? I would say this is about. I, I 90? would say, yeah, eighty. Eighty to ninety. Eighty-ish. Yeah. yeah. Um, I would say yeah, on the younger side, eighty proof-ish, maybe ninety tops. There's a little bit of a dessert feel to it when you really start to break it down and. You're on your third or fourth sip. 
Uh, a little shortbread, maybe. Um, shortbread. Yeah. Interesting. And the proof, I think, is starting to show itself a little bit more. It's starting to get a little warm in the chest. I'm going to say it's about 90 proof. Okay. But who knows? We're who obviously knows? outside of our depth here. This knows. Th yeah, that does know. Um, oh, you pulled out six, not nine. No, it's nine. Ha 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 ha. Numbers joke. And yeah, that's about that's about all I can say. I, I, I would like to know. Whoa, uh, so this is 93 proof. Okay. Uh, this is a US whiskey. American whiskey. Yep. Okay. I would say it's like a corn whiskey. It does not read <clears throat> 92 or 93 to me. Does so I said 90, I was, I was three off, yeah, not bad, right. yeah. not bad. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is few. Oh. Dark chocolate, cereal, smoky, spicy, rye, toasted cherry, malted barley, and bread. Dark chocolate is like the biggest note, but I didn't taste any of that. I, I mean, did get the cereal, the cereal and the smoky. And the cereal and the rye, uh, the malted barley. Maybe it was like that cherry malted barley that was reading licorice -y to me. I don't know. The, the bread, I think that's probably when I said shortbread. I think that was sort of like that little little note. Maybe. Uh, um, but yeah, the dark chocolate. And I wouldn't anything, have ever called this spicy. No. Which is interesting too. Um, if anything, it would have been more of a milk chocolate taste on the finish mm -hmm. than, than dark chocolate. Yep. But yeah, few single malt whiskey. So this is a single malt American whiskey. Yep. Very interesting. You can learn more about this bottle at flaviar.com. Mm -hmm. That is correct. It says the card, the front of the card has fun things on it and I like that. How many whiskeys have you already had? Few. That many? No, just one. <laughs> <laughs> ha, ha I see what you did That's there. A little turn of a phrase there. I like it. Okay, nice. few. We haven't ventured into few. I think we do have a, uh, we do have a, a, a bottle, bottle in our collection, but we haven't um, really gone into their uh, their catalog. So no. no, no, it's nice to have. Good to have that one on the experience. Uh, check mark list, yeah, you know? This box has been full of a lot of things we've never tried before and it's been I think completely full of things that's we've never tried before. <laughs> really cool though, because yeah. I mean, you may not have gone out and bought a bottle of something otherwise, but it's nice to have a little taste of all these different things that mm -hmm. you can try them without having to invest in all those different bottles. Thanks again to Flaviar.com for uh, sponsoring this series and sending us this box. Uh, you can check out their YouTube channel. It's mm -hmm. youtube.com slash Flaviar. And, um, you know, for us, you know where we are. We're whiskeyambitions.com for glassware, uh, t-shirts, challenge coins, and, and so much more. More coming soon here in 2020. And then there's patreon.com if you'd like to become one of the, our patrons and get those benefits as well. If that's patreon.com slash it's bourbon. Cool. Well, um, hey, if you haven't subscribed to us already, you can do so by clicking up here, down here for Flaviar. Other suggestions of videos here. We hope to see you in those. Thanks, Sarah. Thanks, Chad. Okay. We'll see you all tomorrow. Until then, drink more whiskey.